What's up Panda Gang, it's your boy PGM here with another video. So last episode we went into the restricted part of the library, um, learned that we can use some ancient magic you know, we've got like bars for that that we fill up, we can use some ancient kick ass fucking magic you know stuff. Um, we've just been back to Professor Fig I think, and I can't remember what we're doing next so let's carry on. Right, let's see what we've got on here, because I we'll know that we left a couple of things. Let's do our pose first. Luke and Brattleby. It's time to preview a dueling metal. See if we're a new school champion. Meet me at the usual place for the final round of cross ones. Also, the training dummy is still available. Final round. Okay. Yeah, me and Sebastian will do that, innit? Trust me. Quest. Oh, fuck. Ask me to meet her at the Hamlet. I need to attend her biology class. Successfully avoid enemy attacks by dodge rolling. Cast incendiary enemies. Professor he cats sign. Professor he cats when attacks by dodge on shows when it's cast send on a few enemies. My field guide will not go through this assignment, but my map would still prove useful. Hmm. The final round of duel is available at cross ones. It will determine the champion of the school. I should see Lucan. The cross ones club meet regular clock to I should be able to do a spell combination practice too. Okay, let's go do that first. Do a couple of side quests, innit? Just don't want to get straight through the story, you know. Took its time, didn't it? Hmm. Can I do anything to that? No. Oi! Can you help me? Not at a minute, Bo, no. Ooh. I swear it's just told me to come up here. Oh, it must have told me to go down. It must have told me to go down. I just saw that wrong, you know. Rebellion. Wrong spell. Nope. Nope. Incendio. No. I don't know. We'll figure that out. Looks insane, you know. Oh, we're going to the tower, ain't we? Revelio. Oh, I gotta do that. There's gonna be some water spell, ain't they? Levioso. Accio. Yeah, there's gonna be. There'll be something we'll figure out, gang. I think we're there now. Future champion coming through. Ah, bless. Hello, Lucan. I'd like to practice with the training dummy. Excellent idea. This time will be a bit more of a challenge. Ready? Yeah. That'd be brilliant. Wonderful. I'll set things up. Remember to cast all the spell combinations before the dummy lands again. Say no. If you need to stop practicing before you finish all of them, let me know. I 
here. Incendio, let me also. Good one! Excellent form. This is fun. Akio. Incendio. Let me also. Akio. Incendio. Yeah. Impressive wand work. I'd hate to face you in a duel. Couldn't have done it without you. Yeah, trust me, bro. Thanks, Lucan. My local homie. You've been a great help. Oh, stop. Don't make me blush. Seriously, well done. Training dummies will think twice before challenging you again. Plus, you'll be even more formidable in crossed ones. Other duelists had better beware. Hello, Lucan. Is the final round of cross ones ready? Big match today. It all comes down to this. The moment that we find out if your training and dedication is enough to win it all. Ready for a shot at glory? Ha, yeah, go I on. I certainly am. Brilliant. Are you dealing with a partner? Yes, Sebastian. Then let's get started. We can make this a real victory. That's the spirit. Break through red shields with damage spells. Red shield with damage. Right, okay. Oh, I've got no health. Fuck, I had no health. Or oh, they just fucked me real quick. <laughs> they made a crap's breakfast out of you that round. Care to try again? Yeah, go on. Yes, I'm ready now. Very Let's well. try again Good one more time. But if not, I'll go get potions and that, innit? Because they fucking throw down, then, you know. <laughs> Nah, nah, nah. We'll get some Wig and Wild no, Potion. I don't think so. Not right now. Understandable. But don't take too long. We'll be waiting. Yeah, I just need Wig and Wild Potion. That's all. That's all. Accio. Levioso. Incendio. Eh? Hey? Fuck knows. Um, anyway, quest updated. Quest on down three. Dodge rolling. Okay, so okay, let's go do herbology class. That makes sense because then we can learn how to make Wigan Wild. Hopefully, yo, let's go.
There might be some water filling to fill that up with water. That bolting back there. Something in there, I just know it. Huh. Revelio. This is cool. Is she growing pungus onion again? Good morning, Professor Garlic. How wonderful it is to see you again, Lenora dear. Oh, here. You'll need these for today's class. Uh, um, uh, A little treat for your auntie. Class, please welcome the newest rose in our garden. We do look forward to growing together. How thrilling! I hope Sebastian ain't fell out with us. Again. This year will be filled with enchantment and excitement, but the most important thing cultivated in herbology is knowledge. The prudent herbologist is no more afraid of the venomous tentacula than the bouncing ball. Now then, today we will be acquainting ourselves with the mellifluous tuber known as the mandrake root. Accio. Let's see if we can't make our fibrous friends a bit more comfortable, shall we? <laughs> First, let's protect our ears. Hmm. Now, everyone, Grip their mandrake by the tendrils and give it a firm tug. should envelop the root like a warm, dirty blanket, putting the mandrake right at ease. Repair! I'm very sorry about that. Yours was a bit mature, I'm afraid. All right then, off you go. Splendid work, everyone. Now, for our next task, we'll be planting dittany at our potting tables. You can all get started. I need to have a brief word with our new student. Hmm. I wonder if hippogriffs like knockgrass. Dear Professor Garlic, I very thought of you to remember that strawberries are my favourite. They're sweet as can be. It's no wonder muggles love them so much. Everything you cultivate seems to be of such high quality, from a bit of root to berries. I do hope that my darling niece can learn the skill I shall endure. Tutelage, tutelage, tutelage. Lenora, so adores you, as do all the students, I'm sure. Warmest regards, always, Eleanor Everly. Hey, 
Anything else to collect? The best time to plant a seed is last season. The second best time is now. I do wonder about Professor Fig. He's hardly ever in his classroom. Most strange. Don't worry about Figman. Why can't I talk to Sebastian? Did you know that you can use the Mandrake to defend yourself? Why, the very idea. I think he's a bit, like, not happy with us. I don't know. We'll see. Yes, Professor. Firstly, well done with your Mandrake. They can be rather difficult to get a grasp of. Yeah, I enjoyed that. Actually, I enjoyed it. I couldn't help but catch your enthusiasm. How kind of you. It seems you're already taking to herbology like a mandrake to fresh soil. Now, as I mentioned, next we'll be planting Dittany. Let us find you some seeds. I already have some, Professor. Pick them up in Hogsmeade. You've visited the Magic Neep. Wonderful! A prepared student is bound to bloom. I've arranged for you to have your own potting table here in the classroom. Wasn't easy to spare one on such late notice. Plant the seeds there now, and you can return to harvest them later. Even with soil, sunlight, and a bit of magic, they will take time to grow. Let's see how to balance my star thistle arrangement. Niffler's fancy, or roses? Dittany's restorative properties make it a vital ingredient in the Wiganweld potion, oh, we go. as you all should know from Professor Sharp's class. The leaves of this medicinal herb are used in Wigan Wild. Dittany seeds can be purchased at the blah. Small part, 10 minutes, select. You can fertilize this plant to increase its yield. You can create fertilizer by conjuring a dung composter. Composter. Okay. Done. Once it can be harvested, your Dittany will be ready to use in Wiganweld potion. I'll let Professor Sharp tell you about that. Now, what say we branch out? Introduce you to a different sort of flora, the Chinese chomping cabbage. You'll find that some plants are better suited to uses outside of a cauldron. The cabbages do get testy without something to chew. Fortunately, I have a dummy for them to gnaw on. Be a dear, and let them have a good chomping. Yes, Professor. They're in the other greenhouse. It's just at the end of the footbridge leading out of this room. Your classmate, Mr. Pruitt, has kindly offered to accompany you. Come back and see me when you're finished. Oh, and mind your fingers. They do bite. <laughs> okay. Hello. So I your way to Hogsmeade the other day. Nice to meet you. I'm Leander. I'll be showing you the Chinese chomping cabbages. Up these stairs will take us there. But your lead. Ah. Oh. Nice work in defense against the dark arts, by the way. Excuse me. Your duel with Sebastian. And he's good. <laughs> Thinks he's really good. But you outright slaughtered him. It was brilliant. Oh. Well, oh. thank you. I nearly put Sebastian in his place myself. I mean, I would have, if Hecate hadn't stopped me. Didn't she stop that dragon skull from crushing you? <sighs> Typical Slytherin trick, dropping a dragon skull on someone during a fight. We Gryffindors fight with honor. Uh, no offense. Sorry. Here we are, home of the Chinese chomping cabbage. Go on, grab. Now, see that dummy? Just toss the cabbages at it, and they'll do the rest. Hold LB and tap R to open the tools wheel. Then LB to use your assigned tools. Oh, okay. Oh, 
Look at that. Mouth chomp from anything they can get their uh, mouths on. <laughs> Mum planted some in her garden last year to keep the gnomes out. Did save her the denoming, but they left her honking daffodils in tatters. Vicious little bastards, aren't they? My kind of plants. Not like stupid booba tubers and bouncing bulbs. The kind of plants that just have your back in a fight. Uh, not saying you can't go it alone, but, well, imagine that wasn't a dummy. I suppose they could prove useful outside of the greenhouse. Nothing wrong with a bit of backup, even if it is from a cabbage. It's chaos out there. Trolls in Hogsmeade and such. You can't be above throwing a cruciferous vegetable if necessary. <laughs> and Deathcap has more of them, if you're keen. Other plants too. Ones your parents wouldn't plant in the garden. You get the idea. Anyway, we uh, probably ought to head back to class. Take your time. I'll see you back in class. Revelio. Do we do we give all plums? This orange or radish like fruit floats upside down as it grows. Some believe it can be enhanced one's ability it can enhance one's ability to accept the extraordinary. I think that's everything you know. Incendio. Worth try. I'm just having a quick look around. See if there's any other bits I could pick up. Never know what will come in handy for doing potions. As to why we should always wear our dragon hide gloves, I shall end our lesson here. Terribly sorry, Mr. Clopton. I tended to the Chinese chomping cabbages, Professor. Remarkable plants, aren't they? I hope they weren't too much trouble. Oh, don't see any bite marks or missing digits. And good, as you do seem to be quite green-fingered. Oh, I'm eager to see your skill in the soil continue to blossom. As am I. Plants offer so much. Yeah, they magical do. Magical plants have so much to offer. Mag magical plant to star, I'm that's glad. what I'm saying. Herbology is a bounteous <laughs> subject. Tend to your garden and it will tend to you. Huh. Well, I suppose that's everything. Do come by for a chat sometime. I so enjoy checking in with my new students. Boo! How do we add like another part? Are really relishing their new parts. Only cost me my damned hearing. I wanna talk, we Sebastian. We must Bro! That goes for plants. Bro! Kindness and concern are as necessary in the greenhouse. He don't even want to know as you know. He don't even want to know as you know. Revelio. Nothing in here. So much better when it gets dark earlier. I'd spend all night in that astronomy tower. Revelio. Incendio. 
Revelio. Is it possible to become an aura and not a fellow? Just having a look around, you know, gang, seeing what there is for us. I think this is where we just... Oh, out there. Oh, that's in that secret room, okay. Okay. So, yeah, this is back to where we are now, so I think... We've seen everything that there is in the herbology section, to be fair, in the greenhouses. I think we've seen everything. So we'll go back, we'll have a little check on how our things coming along run. Oh, hang on. What's that sound? Yeah, boy, we ain't been here. We ain't been here. I just leaks us around to that side. Yeah, we have been here. I must have just come from a different way though and missed that little chest. Because I remember being here. I remember this. I remember this. That's just back to the classroom, yeah. And I don't think we can go. Oh! We ain't been in the bamboo Rebellion. one. We ain't been in the bamboo one. I couldn't miss nothing. Nope. Um, what's that? That's a flu flame. Uh, we've just come in that door up there and we come down there. So here? Oh, it's just a room back to there. Okay, but at least we've got everything from there now. Ain't we? Yeah, let's see if our little plant's doing well. How long? 12 seconds. Come now. Come now. One, done. Collect that. Way. Ha 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 ha. That stank, man. Imagine if you had that auto shit. <laughs> right, anyway. Let's see what's in the guide. Collections. Hmm. Reveal all pages. There we go. What's the fin? Inventory. Letter from Professor Garlic. Don't really need them. Um, Did any leaves? Books, weed, stem. Lacing flies. Okay. Quest. The next class I must attend is potions. Oh, they're gonna turn. Yeah, right. And yeah, we'll do potions, gang. Then um, we'll make some wigan wild potion. Then we'll just go fuck all of them up, ain't it? At the um, cross ones thing. Loving this game. I say it every video, I think, but I'm loving this game. I would like to know what you're thinking of it, you know. If you're playing it yourself, what house you're in, you know. I'd like to send them. Oh, what am I missing? I think they've put in work. Someone from the ministry guarding the school after the incident in Hogsmeade. They've Press put in work on this game. It would make them look completely incompetent. I bet he knows more than he's letting on about the Goblin Rebellion. Rebellion.
Oh, I fear it's boys and birds. Boys and birds is increasing my activity outside the origin shop, particularly in the wee hours of the night. Suspicious deliveries being made to the shop's back entrance. Given what we know, the shop's reputation for adding more ores to join those who have already been watching the shop. You are amongst the new additions. So he is an ore. Revelio. I don't see nothing else. Potions is one of the most challenging and hazardous subjects taught at this school. As fifth years, you will be required to reach new heights of both discipline and intellect. You will begin this term by brewing a Wigan Weld potion. Yes. Mr. Come on. Takar, can you tell us why this particular potion might come in handy? Yes, Professor Sharp. The Wigan Weld potion can be used to sterilize and even heal a variety of injuries. It can heal some injuries, but not all. Points for Ravenclaw. Before today's class is completed, each of you will have brewed a Wigan Weld potion of your own. You never know when you might need it. Please begin. Use a strong, even motion when crushing your ingredients. Please be meticulous when adding powder to your potions. One errant sneeze could be disastrous. I see most of you have not forgotten how to stir. Hmm. Not an easy potion to brew. Well done. And Thank from you. Thank you. Experts <laughs> in Hogsmeade. You'd also do well to practice brewing the defensive Edurus potion. Professor Weasley had you acquire the recipe from Jay Pippins, correct? Yes, sir. Good. For the moment, you can find the ingredients you need in my office. But in the future, you'll be expected to provide your own ingredients. Some can be harvested from the plants you grow in your herbology class, and rarer ones can be purchased. Others, however, may be harder to obtain, and will require you to be a bit more... resourceful. Come and see me when you've finished brewing, and we'll see if it was skill or luck the first time around. My parents considered keeping me home from school this year after the rumors of a goblin rebellion. Did I hear Professor Sharp say that you have permission to go into his office? Yes, but why does that matter to you? Brilliant! And it matters because you can be a part of something truly creative. I'm Gareth, by the way. Gareth Weasley. Bit of a prodigy with potions, if I do say so myself. Pleasure to meet you. Wait, are you related to Professor Weasley? She's my aunt. Keeps too close an eye on me for comfort. Ugh. But she can't be everywhere. Listen, anyone with a troll-sized brain can brew an Adjurus potion. I'm working on something that's certain to be spectacular. I'm just missing one tiny last ingredient that will add that extra spark. I suspect that's where I come in. You're as clever as I'd hoped. I simply need a single Fwooper Feather. As you'll already be in Sharp's office with his permission, Perhaps you could grab it for me. Yeah, I'll get you. I'll get you the Fwooper Feather, as long as you're certain Sharp won't miss it. I assure you he won't. Fwooper Feathers aren't that valuable. Wait until you see what I'm brewing. Hurry back to me when you have the feather.
Your potion should not be that cup. Dowel. Rebellion. Gonna know that big ass pink fucking feather's gone. Huh. Might not have been a good idea that. Stations organized and free of clutter. Here's the fopper feather you wanted. Brilliant! Thank you. This is going to take a moment to brew. You should get back to brewing your endurance potion, and I'll tell you when this concoction's finished. Efficiency and potions are two things that cannot be rushed. Have patience and be thorough. Hawklum juice we need. Hawklum juice. Shit. I thought we'd have to do um I thought we'd have to do like the movements for all the potions. It's weird that we ain't had to. And now we add the mallow sweet and that's odd. What's happening? Wait, it's not supposed to. Ah! Oh, the smell. Dragon Dog. What happened? Fucking idiot. <laughs> well done, Gareth. What now, Mr. Weasley? Sorry, Professor. That'll be points from Gryffindor. Again. Mr. Weasley did not do this on his own. His accomplice will answer to me as well. I brewed an Adura's potion as you asked, Professor. I'm surprised you had the time. You seemed rather busy helping Mr. Weasley brew chaos. Don't know what you're on about. I'm not sure what you're talking about, Professor. You will not earn favor with me by failing to take responsibility for your actions. I suggest you heed my warning. As for the work you did today in your own cauldron, I will say you've done well. I confess I was skeptical given the advanced nature of this class and the fact you're a new student i'm glad i was able to meet your expectations a rare occurrence and you do well to remember that you're not a potions master quite yet in addition to having a solid grasp of how to combine various ingredients you should gain an understanding of the ingredients themselves pay particular attention in herbology the plants you nurture there are often essential to the potions you brew here now, I recommend that you find a safe location in which to practice brewing. You cannot leave a hot cauldron simply anywhere. That'll be all. Huh. I think each of us has had enough excitement for one day. Class is dismissed. Got one. Uh, no one. <clears throat> I need to... Uh, I don't know if it's... No, I don't know if it's worth doing that cross ones yet. I think one Wigan Wall potion won't do it. Let's go see what Natty's saying. I just saw that. Here we go. That was it. A 
off on another adventure, are we? What was that? Oh, something that needs to fall out of the water, really I think. Why would anyone this cannot this possibly be. I need my broom. This is wicked. It reminds me of Skyrim. Reminds me of Skyrim, you know. Proper. <laughs> I might do videos of Skyrim. Does anyone want to see them? I love the game, but I know it ain't for everyone. Moonstone. I like that we can roll, you know. We're getting loads of that moonstone, you know. I think we've got quite a bit of that. Woo, did I just see something there? Revelio. No, I'm tripping. all that different to what it actually was, you know. Nearly there, I think, gang. Is that like Hagrid's hut? Yeah, it is. All the pumpkins and that. The hippogriff was laying. This looks intriguing. Here she is. It is good to see you, my friend. Hello, Natty. How are you? I am well, thank you. I was there, and I saw what happened with Rookwood and Harlow at the Three Broomsticks. I have been worried about you. I'm all right at the moment. If you don't mind my asking, why were they looking for you? I've never met Rookwood or Harlow. Perhaps they mistook me for another student. Hmm. A bit odd. The two of them pursuing a Hogwarts student so intently. But whatever the reason, you were clearly in danger. For now. 
it is safe to say that Rookwood and Harlow are a threat to both of us, to all of us. Which is why I wanted to speak to you. Everyone has been talking about you defending Hogsmeade from that troll attack. And I shall never forget watching Sorona stand up to Rookwood and Harlow in the Three Broomsticks. Both of you have inspired me to take a stand of my own. What sort of stand? Men like Rookwood and Harlow are the reason my mother and I left Matibili land. I am not going to sit by and watch them destroy my new home. Rookwood and Harlow are a dangerous pair on their own, and you should know that Rookwood is in league with Ranrock. I had heard they were seen in Hogsmeade together. All the more reason they must be stopped. Rumor has it that Theophilus Harlow runs Rookwood's day-to-day -day operations, taking him down would cripple Rookwood's entire enterprise. That may be true, but shouldn't Officer Singer handle someone like Harlow? I spoke with her. She was polite, but perhaps understandably would not discuss details with a student. I overheard some of Rookwood's lot talking about a massive poaching operation that Harlow was planning. I was thinking that we could investigate a bit, try to get the evidence that Officer Singer needs. All right, but how? I am going to watch and listen and find out precisely what Harlow is up to. I shall reach out when I know more. In the meantime, remember, I am here if you need me. Thank you, Letty. Yeah, bless. Be on your guard. I've always said that travel... I brought... beg your pardon! How dare you threaten me! What's going on here? Yo, nay! Oh, you seen one off, didn't ya? Yeah, wow. Shots are popping off, I think. Beef, nah. Qualms, you're fucking... You're gone. You said you're here. Where are ya? I got the wrong place, I just assumed it was that fucking weirdo. They must have come this way! Think! I've no idea who it is you think I might have seen. I've been busy with my research. I do not have time to- Victor Rookwood don't give a dog shit nip back your time. Oi! Speak of the devil! Mr. Rookwood would like a word with you. A student, you can't be sick. <laughs> Enough out of you. Leave her alone. Stupefy! Yeah, Wagwan. What now? Incendio. What now, dickhead? I'll watch the light go out of your eyes. The cloak of sexual and field guide of a new day with new enemy type. You made them over in such as their weaknesses and certain spells. Ha, ha. Time to teach. We can hold them up. Hang on. I'm not going anywhere with you. Go ahead. Tell Rookwood find yourself. Ah. Impressive. I'm not Just the beginning. Accio. Incendio. Pusio. What on earth just happened? I've never been accosted in such a manner. Then so close to Hogwarts. Flowers look weird, didn't they? Are you Flowers right? look weird as fuck. I am. Thanks <laughs> in small part to your excellent defensive skills. Care to tell me why two Ashwinders were ready to dispatch me to get to you? Ashwinders? Victor Rookwood's thieves and extortionists, his little cronies. They seemed quite keen on you. It's a long story, but thank you for your help. Hmm. Well, you've avoided them for the moment. Priya warned me things were getting dangerous. Best get moving on my research before they return. 
You mentioned someone named Priya. Yes, my wife. She's the one who piqued my interest in Merlin. Gave me a book when we were students at Oh, Oh, oh well, well Merlin's big. Hufflepuff, brilliant potioner. Has her own shop in Nocturne Alley. She's a travelling vendor. Here's what's going on in the Highlands before I do. Huh. You're a researcher? Nora Treadwell at your service. Historian and archaeologist specialising in Merlin's work and life. Merlin? Of the legend of King Arthur? The very same. Merlin attended Hogwarts, you know, and I'm studying some curious fixtures he left here centuries ago. Fixtures? These vine-covered pillars, dozens of them all around the area. I've taken to calling them the Trials of Merlin. I believe he created them as a diversion for his fellow Slytherins. <laughs> he was terribly fond of puzzles and enigmas. I can see why you're so interested in Merlin. I'd be keen to know more about the trials. Well then, I'll let you in on a little secret. No one has yet managed to figure out how they work. But I believe I have just unlocked a crucial clue. I suspect that Mallow Sweet is an important component in getting the trials to work. Mallow Sweet? Versatile herb. Merlin repeatedly mentioned it in his writings. Mallow Sweet. I had just arrived to test my theory when I was so rudely interrupted. You see, each swirl in Merlin's writing has its symbol in the center. That started me thinking, what if? The Mallow Suite is meant to be placed at the center of the symbols. Precisely. Would you care to do the honors? We can see what comes of our little hypothesis. I brought a trunk chock full of Mallow Suite with me. It's just over there by my tent. This trunk? Yes, take plenty, even if you already have some. I have the Mallow Suite. Lovely. Now, notice the vines on these pillars here, as well as a stone swell on the ground. Each trial has these features. Place the Mallow Suite on the swell, and we'll see what happens. Hey? Oh. See that? The vines disappeared. What should I do now? Hmm, this is uncharted territory. I am curious about these piles. Lion. Incendium. Merlin's beard! The flames make the pyre sing. Hardly believe it. Revelio. I take it we can call that a success? We can indeed. However, I now have even more questions. How does it work? I must review my notes. I may have missed something. Are all of the trials like this one? Hmm? Oh, not precisely. Well, I think each has those telltale vines and the swirl on the ground. You should feel free to solve them as you come across them. I believe I have what I need to continue my research. My guess is that each will also require Mallow Suite, which you can find in Hogsmeade should you need more. I really must be off. Such a pleasure to meet you. Likewise. And do be careful out here. Now, I've got what I needed. I'm I shall blessed. return to the safety of my notes and books. Oh, it's literally all of them flowers, you know. That's really weird. I'm gonna, um... 
go back so we wonder who Scrope knows about the old book you found for Professor Fink. Scrope can help you. And you can help Scrope. Get to the courtyard past the pendulum. If you don't know it, you'll see it easy enough. And don't tell anyone what you're up to. Okay, we'll want it. Especially Professor Blank. In fact, no, we won't. That's a trick, you know. And I want to, um... In fact, what we'll do... Handy resource indeed, your field guide. I'm most pleased to be included. Hogwarts map. I need. Oh, I'm gone. Let's go there. I'm hoping it'll reboot. And we're back at Hogwarts. Right, I think we're going to save here, gang. We're back at Hogwarts, and let's just check everything we've got here. Um, inventory. Damn there. Mushrooms that leap serendipity. I don't know what it says. In invisibility potion. Invisibility potion. Huh. Um, let's see what challenges we've done. Combat. Defeat dark wizards. Dragon hide protects his cloak. Yeah. Exploration. Merlin's trial. Increased storage. Okay. Okay. Collections. Enemies. The last one to scout. Agencies, which is will surprise their opponents with back to back attacks. Their powerful reductor curse cannot be blocked by shield charm, but interrupting that cast with a severing charm will spin into the point of losing control and hitting one of their own gang. Okay, I'll just fuck them up in my own way though. Right, yeah, that's it, gang. So, we'll keep that quest there. We're gonna go. I'm gonna save game. Over at save game. Yeah, I hope you've enjoyed this episode, gang. I think we're getting through it pretty well. I think everyone every every episode has been something happening really i mean the game keeps giving us stuff to do it keeps throwing up cool stuff i'm enjoying it i'm really enjoying it but um yeah everybody be safe stay lit panda gang